It's time for another cool tool review. This time we're gonna take a look at the Hobart Handler 140 MIG welder. This is my welder. I got it on Amazon for around $500 and in my opinion, it is the best quality entry level welder you can get. I'm gonna show you why. I just got into welding about a year and a half ago and I'll admit I was intimidated. Luckily, I had a friend show me the basics and he let me borrow his Lincoln electric welder to work on my first go-kart frame for Maker Faire. But after a while, I realized I really needed to invest in my own welder. The obvious choice was to go with a Lincoln since I was always used to using one and they're easy to get at Home Depot. But after doing some research, this $500 Hobart had a lot of reviews raving about its quality, so I gave it a shot and I'm glad I did. Here's why I recommend this as a great beginner's MIG welder. First, it runs off standard 110 volt household power. Professional welding setups typically run off 220 and the ones that run off 110 are often a little weak. This one has plenty of power for getting nice welds on steel tubing and angle iron. The trade-off is that it can't do continuous welds for more than a few minutes before it needs to rest. If welding is your job and you're doing it all day, that's an obvious deal breaker, but for what I do as a hobbyist, I'm never spending more than a minute on any particular weld, so I never even think about this limitation. The second great benefit for beginners is that it comes set up for flux core wire right out of the box and includes a reel of flux wire. What this means as a beginner is that you can get welding straight away because the flux wire doesn't need shielding gas, which most beginners don't have on hand. After a few days, I was able to score a tank of shielding gas and some regular MIG welding wire, which delivers better results for me. When you make this switch, you have to change the polarity on the welder by unscrewing and swapping two wires, but it takes just a minute, and I think overall, most beginners will be happy that this is set up for flux core out of the box so that they can get right to practicing. The third thing that's great about this package is that the components are high enough quality that you may never need to replace them. From the gas regulator to the gun to the 10-foot grounding cable and the extra tip, there's a higher touch on every little component compared to what I've seen on other entry-level welders. My impression is that to compete with Lincoln and Home Depot and Harbor Freight, Hobart is betting on quality to differentiate what they're offering. And it works for me. It got me through an intense build with my latest go-kart. And for the record, no one from Hobart is paying me to say any of this, just to be clear. If you've been intimidated by welding, I encourage you to go take a class at your local makerspace or have a friend show you the basics. As a maker, it opens up a lot of possibility. If you want to pick up this same setup, I've got a link for you in the description along with what I use for a helmet, a welding table, wire brush, and gloves. All of them are inexpensive but useful options. And remember, you can see thousands of reader-recommended tools like these at cool-tools.org.